So Apple has released Safari extensions for Safari browser in iOS 15. And in this video, I'm just going to share with you how you're going to be able to just install Safari extensions on your devices and then see how they work. So if you're new here, consider subscribing. Don't forget to like this video, share to anyone you think this is going to be helpful to them. And without further ado, let's just dive into the video. So first of all, what you're going to do is you're going to go to your settings and then you check out your Safari browser right here. And then when you scroll down, you're going to see extensions right away and then you tap on extensions and you're going to see there are no extensions right here. So what you're going to do next is you tap on more extensions and you're going to get this pop up page in your app store. And some of them are paid extensions. If when you download them, you have to pay some money right here like this one. You have to pay some money before it start working. So I'm going to tap on this, which is not a paid product at the moment. So we're just going to download and after it's done downloading, we are going to check how it works and how you're going to activate this extension right here on your safari browser so you stick around you share to people you think there's going to be helpful to them and if you've not subscribed yet hit the like button and subscribe to this channel because i have a lot i want to share with you so what you're going to do is you just tap on open and then your app is going to open going to give you a welcome note and all you scroll through to the end and then you're going to see it like this so before you're going to see this is working what you need to do is you're going to go to your browser and then you open a page right and when you open the page you see these three dots right here you tap on it like this so when you tap on these three dots you're going to scroll through till you see this one right here turn off content blocker so when you tap on it basically it's going to reload again and it's going to block whatever you are blocking right here and this is how the extension works when you scroll down to you're going to see it right here you can turn it off and basically that is very cool so if you want to know how this works perfectly you're going to come here and then you can check through there's an add and tracker blocker and an annoyance blocker web resources and then custom rules so you can check out any of them you feel like you want if you want to block ads you just tap on this like this and you block the ads if you want to hide ads you want to hide them you want to block trackers you're going to block trackers right here annoyance too you're just going to block some social widgets, hide widgets, privacy banners, and then hide banners. You're just going to block them right here. So there is an extension. You can just try and then play around them. And if you want to see your extensions after you've done installing them, what you're going to do is you just go back to your settings and then you're going to go to Safari, like I said, and you hit on extensions and you're going to see your extension you've installed right here. You don't want to get them working. You're just going to tap like this and you're going to turn it off. And basically you are good. This is not going to work right now. And when you go back to your browser too, you're not going to see it right there. In case you just refresh your app, you're going to, you're not going to see the extension right here anymore. And basically that is very cool so if this video was very helpful just give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe to the channel share to anyone you think this is going to be helpful to them peace